Hello everyone, welcome to our channel for LCD parts. Today, I'm going to introduce our laser machine called TBK958B and also the TBK air purifier. It has ability to remove back glasses of iPhone. It also can engrave text and images to iPads and other materials. Also, if any new models come out, you can easily update the machine and continue to use it for the new phones. The best thing about this machine, you do not need an extra computer because it's already built in. Now, let's start how we actually separate the back glass of iPhone XR. Let's start first how we turn on the machine. Once you turn on the machine, make sure to put this button up and the speed button must be turned all the way to the right and then take off the lid so we recommend to use this aluminium adhesive tape to protect the color of frame before we start the process after we finish the covering the frame also make sure to cover the camera too and then place your phone to the alignment mode to press the close button when we place our phone to alignment mode, we need to go first login and click on the administrator and for passcode press 146 time and then login. Go to file, pick the open and pick the drawing, pick the iPhone and now we have iPhone XR. We need to find iPhone XR back, which means this one. But to make sure there is enabled preview, we need to press this button to show how we can see the phone exactly with the laser. Now we need to check first in Ferret preview to see which laser we can see the light around the frame our phone with the laser light to the around if you need to move to the right and left we can use the follow with the keyboard arrow buttons and then we need to press the focus and after then we can do stop because i checked it already we have in perfect view and then just Press on the laser. Next thing you do is put the smoke purifier box over the aligner and turn this button all the way to the max. And then print. And it starts already. So now I'm going to show you how you do engraving with this machine. Let's start. After you plug the flash disk in, you are going to see pop-up screen. You can just hit the image manage button. You will see what we have on the flash disk is on the right side and select whatever you like. Then click on the import button to move it to the local directory. Then you can pick from the local directory to use your image. Now, 
I'm going to use our phone LCD parts logo to show you how the process works. I will use on iPad. After you pick your image, you are going to see it on the screen and you can also do any kind of adjustments such as you can make it smaller, bigger, or just move it around, change way of it. And basically you just play it around however you like it. You can see a preview before you actually start the process by clicking on Inferit Preview button. After you are done by checking the preview, click on Stop and just hit the Print button to start the process. Thank you guys for watching us. Please follow us. If you have any questions, please comment in the below. We'll be back with the new updates. Take care until then.